I played Wizard of War when it first came out back in the early 80s. Do you remember the place where you played that game? Yes, there was an arcade in Raleigh called Scoreboard on Millbrook Road. Great. And did you fall in love with the game right away or did it become one of your favorites later? I did because it was tough. So uh, were you better than all your friends at the time or was there another person who was even better than you were? I think as I recall we were equally as horrible at it. <laughs> so a lot of quarters went into the Wizard A lot of quarters. <laughs> a lot of quarters. Okay. What's your what's your high score? On About 109,000. Okay. Wow, that's really good. And how long had it been since you played Wizard of War before you played it again at Scott's Arcade? Um, I played it on an emulator over the years, but it's not quite the same. Um, so Scott's would probably be the first time since 2019. Okay, what would you say is the hardest thing about Wizard of War? Uh, not getting eaten by the monsters. <laughs> okay. Okay. Um, They're pretty aggressive. Okay. What did you learn about the game strategy that helped you get better? Uh, it's kind of like Pac-Man in a way, where there's a safe spot, usually on every map, that you can sit. And sometimes you might have to toggle back and forth between one direction or another. But there's usually a safe spot on every map that you can sit and pick off the monsters as they come to you. Did you learn the safe spots just through trial and error? Some was trial and error. A uh, few I picked up out of a book in the early 80s. Uh, I can't find the book now, but um, that's how I learned my strategy. Okay. Um, do you know any interesting trivia about this game in terms of you know, how it was made or any, anything about it that a lot of people maybe don't know? Um, the only thing I can think of off the top of my head is it uses basically the same set of hardware as GORF. Okay. What's maybe you know some basic tips for somebody who's playing for the first time and wants to get a little bit better? Beginners, it's probably best to play with a buddy two players and find spots where you can sit either back to back or in a protected, uh, protected corridor and that way you as a team can pick off all the monsters. Okay. Uh, what's your favorite part about the gameplay? What's the feature of the game that you really love? I like fighting the wizard because he doesn't give up until you either kill him or he kills you. Okay. If if you could change something about the game in terms of the levels or the design, what's one thing that you would change? Um, maybe more random levels than what you get, and fix the bugs, what I call the bugs where the safe spots are. <laughs> <laughs> okay. Uh, you think they could take away the safe spots or make it harder? I've seen a couple people play using some strategies I never thought of. That surprised me. Um, I won't say what they are, but if you pop around YouTube and search, you okay. just might find it. Okay. Um, what's another similar arcade game from this era that you also like? Uh, I like Robotron. Okay, great. Uh, how long have you been coming to Winners and Losers? Uh, probably three to four years. Okay. Have you discovered a game at Wieners and Losers that you had never played before? I've discovered several. No, I mean, there's a lot of interesting games in there, a lot of variety, and it's, it's hard to pick out you know, which ones, aside from Wizard of War, I like better than others. Uh, do you have any stories or memories uh, that come to mind when you think back to your time as a, a child when you were playing the games in the arcade? Um, I grew up in California in the early 70s, and I remember pinball, and I remember some of the electromechanical arcade games, but I really didn't get into the arcade games until the late 70s when we moved to North Carolina, and it started with pinball and evolved into video. I bought my first pinball when I was 15, 
my dad was jealous and bought a pinball the following year. And then we got a few arcade video games. I remember Atari Stunt Cycle. Uh, I believe we had a gunfight. And a couple other games as well. Bye.